this is your life. And this is the most depraved street in the land. You guessed it. Sorry Nation Street. Right, Jack? Alright, oh, it's a fucking shambles. Yes, this is Jack Duckworth. Lovable adulterer and cabaret Casanova. But not this week's entry into the book. Because I run the show. You heard it. Me. Now this is the Rover's return. And currently, they're going about their day talking shit about each other and getting rat assed Jack, I think you can pop in now. Have you told Ivy she's banned from Thoffy? No, I will do. She's had the roll shelf. She'll be too pissed get her on bus to get fresh go for it. I see Jack's bought some more pigeons in. Six more, and they've shit all out windowsill. Hey, it's time out, so Jack! Get in here, you idle old twat. I know, I'll, I'll behave better this time. I just need num some nud seam. Oh, ah, for fuck's sake. Sorry, everybody. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, me. Yeah, you will be. you mumbling prick. Go on, then. I see Jack's bought some more pigeons in. Yeah, and this shot like fuck, on not windowsill. Six of them. <laughs> Anyways, time out's up. Jack, you useless twat. Get it, you're sending here. Well, if you spoke to me like that, I'd be giving you six of the best. But as it happens, I'm purely here to hand you, Vera Duckworth, this big red book. This is your life. <laughs> you silly bastard. I'm half cut. Fuck off, you. Taxi's booked. Are you ready or what? What's the matter with you? I need a piss. <laughs> And a kebab. <laughs> well, it's not in London as we're doing this properly. So we're just a few steps down the road at a converted working men's club. <laughs> Meters running. Oh, you're a shit out. <laughs> Listen, get your handbag, sup your drink, and let's fuck off. Well, have you sobered up? No, I'm fucked. <laughs> Sit down and shut up, woman. Plenty to get through. Now, Vera, you've been the long-suffering wife of Jack. He's just had a do with the sound girl backstage, but he's ready to come and say hello now. He's a bloody room. Jack the Lad Duckworth. <laughs> Get blood up, pull your eye out. I'm a slut. I don't know what I see in you. Go and sit on your hands, you absolute cad. And I'm sorry to say, the whole of Sorry Nation Street have come down for a free piss-up. And here they are, starting with dithering Derek Wilton. Well done, Vera. Oh, where's the weary of an half? Mavis Wilton. Oh, she's here. Alma Sedgwick. Oh, you make me question my sexuality. Well, you know what I am. Oh, Betty Turpin. I'd rather be at home. Don Brennan. Bloody psycho, yo. Curly Watts. Oh, it's my adopted son. When are you going to get a shag? Deirdre Langton Barlow Rashid. Stop copying me pen. Jenny Bradley. You want to sell your fucking father out? An extra. Who the fuck are you? Free beer. Phyllis Pierce. Curtsy for me. Will you get Percy's pants off? Are you feel that? Kevin Webster. Will you get rid of that bloody tash? And go all wanking. Percy Sugden. Oh, Phyllis is over there. Get a centre. Sally Webster. Look at your dress like Freddy Star. And Kenneth Barlow. Here he is, philandering bastard. State of this lot. Fuck off, Ken. Fuck off, Ken. <laughs> Well, Vera has a point, Sally. What is that suit all about? Are you taking the piss? Yes, I am. I wore it because Vera's taking the piss herself with those shoulder pads. Having said that, at least she's not got that blasted afro going on tonight. Ken, apparently you're bitter again. Is that right? 
Well, yes I am, I'm afraid. It seems again I've been overlooked for this program. I wanted to repeat filming. There's no evidence of my episode anywhere, it seems. Oh, I've got to say, I'm really starting to think that this is a conspiracy. I get the piss ripped out of me daily by the cast and ITV. Y yes, yes, laugh it up. Laugh it up. I've recently been treated for increasing wind trouble, and I put it down to the likes of you, twit cast like Duckworth here, and Ada Sharples breaking my balls constantly. How many people here have my bonking record? I, for one, love that, so however you see it, everyone can suck it. I'm surprised his aren't left. <laughs> <laughs> yes, fuck Barlow. Anyway, our next guest couldn't be asked coming down this evening. She's been in pathos working her way through the locals like a true Sorry Nation Street barmaid, Bat Lynch. A up V? I'm sorry I'm not there, cock, but that's precisely why I'm spread out here. I'm shagged out and I'll probably have an heart attack in the next ten minutes. But hey, I'm pummeling away like Ken, except mine are exotic and greasy. I'm more popular than Ken over here, and me This Is Your Life is available to watch. Fuck <laughs> off! <laughs> Don't let them fool you, kid. This is a life. Arse is up V. God help me. Mine will be in a minute. <laughs> Good lord, what a hussy. Moving on, you once had a fling with a notorious comic. We'll hear his version, Mr. Bernard Manning. Hello, Sticky V. Getting on all right in that street? I always said I should have moved there with you. I've not forgotten that paint shed, you know. Some rum times in there, I recall. I've still got a chew hole on me old man. Tends to happen when a paint tin falls on your head mid suck. I'm like a failed Jew, but I wear it with pride. Best of luck. Get in there, Jack. Now we sparked outrage in the activists. Here's a picture of you, Vera, looking like a right twat. And here's a visit from another, and one you know all too well. You know him as our titty, and he's decided to swing by after we lobbed him a tenner. Hey, ma'am, your fucking purse is empty. Yes, the filthy, scheming, foul, moral rogue himself, our titty Duckworth. I can see two of you. Bad enough, we won. Oh, man, your face you're gone has come to see you in another ten years. Nearly took me out with his lying Pinocchio snout. <laughs> Kevin's moustache twin now, isn't he? Vera, this is your life, and you first arrived on Surrey Nation Street in 1974, looking like a Mediterranean gypsy. You burst onto the scene by mouthing off at the union rep at Baldwin's Casuals. I've had 30 bob taken out my wages for the last two weeks, and if you don't do something, I will. Why do I give a shit? They say you take too many piss breaks. Are you incontinent? It's got fuck all to do with you, I know that much. It's natural. And I've got fucking rights. If I want to take 32 piss breaks a day, I bloody will. You get fuck all done in a day. Then I shall be a fucking union rep. And following that some years later, here's you throwing shit at poor Jack over here. Obviously sensitive viewers call the number on the screen if affected by this. They're in the stalls now and ready to go, wasting a lot of time here. Starters orders and they're off. And it's tip for twat quickly go on, away son. and here's prick. Go on, go on, you sexy bastard. Tip for twat just in front of scrotal ferret by length. Bring me some brass, you got it. Bunch together. So wanks a lot and any hole goal son. bringing up third and fourth as tip for twat. Come on, a few lengths get out of here and off me back. And he holds a goal jump that well with scrotal ferret still in contention. Come on, get up. And he holds a goal, is still one Get up, get up, get shifting. Go on, I'm gonna get off me tits tonight. Go on. Tip for twap, jump that awkwardly. Oh, he's fucked it. Go on, twap give us a chance, you stupid useless two, big nostril fucking twat. Cost me 50 fucking knicker there. What a shit of the Duckworth. Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck. Jack, I bought another fucking stupid dog. It were on offer. It can go with other as a pair, it's tacky as fuck. Matching dogs, wall optics. Here you feel like Queen. We should get tea cozies next, what do you reckon? She's had a few gins, Jack. I'm a bad influence, what can I say? Hey, give it over. I'm gonna go and put them together. Don't you be going anywhere, I wanna fuck off. Where's to the dog? It was here. It were horrible pot shit. Are you saying this is what you've sold? I've bought me own fucking dog. Now give over, flaming whingy woman. Calm 48 down. quid for me own twatting dog. 48? 
I can't only give it 25. Hey, what? I'll murder you. Hey, now hang on. I'll twat you. I'll break this round, you lousy fucking Swede. No, Vera. You've had a few now, let's be fair. And they'll be having a few more at your wake. What's going on? Sesame Street rehearsals, my dear. Big Bird chasing Bert. Get out of me way, you old bitch. I'll cave your bloody head in. Oh. Come back here, you. You. Oh, you fair packed him with that, you mad old bitch. That's done it for me. Vera Duckworth, this is your life. Oh, tack it. Fucking imbeciles.